Should prayer be allowed at school board meetings? That's what one organization is trying to prevent. The National Freedom From Religion Foundation says Colleen ISD violated constitutional law by praying before school board meetings. Earlier this evening, local residents came together to try and convince the board their freedom of religion should not be attacked. News 10's Trevette Tatras has the story. My God is they came together singing and praying in protest of a formal complaint filed by the National Freedom From Religion Foundation saying the district had violated constitutional law by allowing prayer at school board meetings. We want to hand our children a better future than one that is the product of continuously backing down to those who would strip away our religious liberties. With more than 2,500 signatures, they presented petitions to the school board pleading their case. We're not trying to force religion. We're not trying to establish Christianity. We are simply maintaining the, the freedom to pray as we have always done. A lawyer with FFRF says they're not trying to violate anyone's religious beliefs. FFRF you know, respects everyone's private right to um, hold the religious beliefs that they choose and even to express them uh, in a public forum. The only time we get involved is when the government is promoting one religion over others in violation of the Constitution. But some parents don't believe that's true. The cafeteria, the classroom, we want him to know he has the freedom to pray wherever he wants. The school district has hired a lawyer and is hoping to resolve the issue soon. But until then, citizens like these will continue to pray while they say they can. Trevette Tatras, KWTX, News 10.